Hey everyone, it's Quentin from Storage Controllers this time, and I've released a pretty good upgrade for Storage Controllers. Uh, let's just go over the changes. The first thing that you'll notice is you see here we have this uh, storage controller is connected to 126 controllers which if you break it or whatever is going to be a pain but now you can move it around and it will remain connected to everything that's supposed to be connected to same if you break it let's just put it back there you can see it's still linked to all the controllers. Uh, another change is the upgrades. So let's just link this guy to a few things. Grab some of that stuff. Uh, there are various upgrades here. This is the bronze upgrade. You can see it instantly turns it into a bronze uh, storage controller. So that'll also save you some time, hopefully. Uh, if I go into creative here, you can see the uh, recipe for them is zero. That's just because it's not a real tool, but basically it's the plates that you would have needed and the linker just to complete the recipe. So it's uh, you don't actually need to build every single upgrade you can go straight from copper to copper nickel, no problem. The only, uh, I guess, upgrades that you can't do is you can't upgrade between, like you can't upgrade from one bronze to the other. Even though black bronze is technically the better, it will only upgrade copper. Now, if you got this thing, and actually you can middle click if you're in creative. So you can see, I'll put this guy down it's linked to 126 containers. So if you want to wipe this out, you would just go back to survival and put it in a crafting grid with your linker. And then when you pull it back out again, it will be reset and will no longer be linked to anything. Oh, and the last change by popular demand is you can link storage controllers one to another. So let's uh, grab this guy and I'm going to control click on this one and now uh, this one is actually linked to I don't know if I'll be fast enough yeah, you can just see oh yeah this one's slower but as soon as it goes into the fast Cooper nickel one it gets distributed so yeah, and you can also control, well, no, I don't know where my stuff is. No, oh, there's a link here. You can also uh, control shift click to remove it again. So it's just the control so this doesn't get confused and it knows if you're clicking on a storage controller, it wants to add that link the storage controllers together. So I wasn't sure about doing that at first, but lots of people really wanted that to be able to transport between storage systems so why not and yes it's technically possible to create a loop of storage controllers where they just cycles around and around uh i guess that's up to you if you want to do that or not oh and the one thing you can see here this thing's on the floor what if the storage controller has something inside it when you upgrade it it'll just dump the contents on the ground so best just wait till it is completed uh, transmitting stuff so yeah hopefully that uh, makes it uh, even more useful for you and uh, yeah uh, looking forward to uh, using it myself thanks for watching